Hey guys, you're with me, Kevin, your scuba professional, and today we're here to review the new Mares Seal Skin Men's Wetsuit that we've got available on our website. This is a really, really great wetsuit for diving in cooler or cold waters, specific to the East Coast and sort of Cape Town areas. This is the ideal suit for you. It's packed full of features, so let's just run through them. We're going to start at the top and work our way to the bottom. One of the first things I noticed about the suit is it's made of a super high stretch neoprene, which is really good great because this is a six millimeter suit so it's quite thick but it's really stretchy so it's super comfy to get on and get off one of the things i really like is what they call the s seal technology so uh around the suit every little bit of seaming and stitching has been painted or sealed with this really really cool uh, sort of rubberized paint and that stops any water from penetrating through the suit and out again going a long way to keep you warm so i think that's a really great addition it also makes the suit a lot more rugged and lets it stand up to the wear and tear of diving a lot better as well because there's no chance of any of that stitching running so that's the main benefit of the the suit uh, up at the top neck section over here it's got a little neck zip just below the, the Adam's apple so that'll make it much more comfortable if you're sitting on a boat quite often when you're diving in the colder waters Port Elizabeth Cape Town those areas can be quite warm outside the water and quite cold in the water so if you find you're getting a bit hot you can just zip down or if you're out on one of those boat rides and you get that gag reflex zipping this down goes a long way to help you it does have the glide skin or titanium graphite paint on the inside there around the neck seal and the neck seal is double stitched so it's folded over and stitched again and there's a soft bit of velcro with a plastic velcro tag at the back of here so that'll create quite a nice neck seal around and keep you really really warm when you go diving so I think that is really great the suit is broken down into a number of different panels making it quite ergonomic so over the knees and the arms they've bent it in with specific panels and that makes it a lot more comfortable to wear as opposed to those b-grade suits which hold you out like a seal so these ones are quite nice in the fact that they're ergonomic and you can you can fit in them really really well uh, down the arms at the extremities over here they've also got the what they call the glide skin or the graphite titanium type paint at the bottom and that just creates more of a seal and stops water from traveling in and out this isn't a dry suit and um, they sort of touch on it being a semi dry but water does still get into the suit and you warm up that small bit of water but it lets a lot less water as opposed to a standard wetsuit and then on each arm section over here they have an anti-slip pad so it's a uh, like a raised rubberized paint that they put on so if you've got any instruments computers or compasses it's not going to slip around as you go down and the the suit starts to compress and it has uh, the new hood holder technology so they call it the smart pocket retainer on the leg over here so it's just a big velcro patch and there's a hood holder over there but you can buy a uh, an external pocket for the side of this wetsuit which you can just velcro on so you just take off these blanking plates velcro it on and then you've got an extra pocket on the suit which I think is really cool um, moving further down the, to the knees they've got raised pads on the knees over here so it's a slightly different material to the neoprene it's a it's a nice sort of stitched material they put on there which will give a lot more uh, wear and tear protection over the knees if you're sort of kneeling down as you're crawling up to get onto boats or if you should you accidentally rub up against one of the rocks or pieces of coral when you're diving this will go a long way to protect the knees and then uh, down on the ankles you've got a big ankle zip over there which opens up and then you can see the glide skin uh, titanium paint on the inside there what's really good to this you can slide your feet into it and then once your foot is through you can fold this up the section in on and in on in on itself there we go in on itself and um, to create more of a semi-dry seal your boot can go over the top and then you can zip the wetsuit over so that gives you a good bit of thermal protection around the, the ankles and that goes for both legs over there which is great and then turning the suit around to, to the back, there's a number of panels down the back as well, making it really, really comfortable. They have a, a YKK marine grade zip at the back. One of the things I really like is this chrome zipper that they've put on. So it's not a plastic zipper, it's not a chrome zipper. And you've got your Maris tag at the bottom just to help hold the suit down when you zip it up. Uh, top tip from me, however, is to always get your buddy to help you zip up. So you arch your back, get your buddy to zip up. Makes it much easier than you trying to pull the suit up because you do put a lot of strain on the side of the suit if you try to zip it up yourself. Um, and then on the inside of the suit, 
There's an extra flap of neoprene over there just to seal over the seat to give you more thermal protection. And then on the inside, it's your standard neoprene on the inside there. They stayed away from the fur skin. Um, it's just standard neoprene, but the suit itself is really, really warm because it doesn't allow that much water through. So overall, I think it's a really great suit for diving in cooler waters. So if you're going to go diving under 20 degrees, even down to Cape Town where you're getting sort of 7, 8 degrees, this is the ideal suit for you to go diving with. And one of the bonuses is it comes with this free six millimeter Mares hoodie as well. Also got the graphite titanium paint, which will seal up around the neck. And it's got really great uh, drains on the ears and on the top of the head. So you can just see there's a few things there. But if I turn it around, one of the things Mares have done with this hood, which is really good for diving in colder waters, is you'll find that when you're diving with a hood that doesn't have air drains, is it creates a cone head like effect as the bubbles travel up through the hoodie. By having the holes over the ears on the top, that allows the, the air to drain out. But if you're in cold water, is that gets really really cold so what uh, Mario's have done is double sealed it so they've got the holes but then there's another patch of neoprene over the top of the head on the side so that stops water from draining cold water from draining back in it allows the air out but it doesn't allow the cold water back in so I think that's a really great addition to the seats as well and this uh, hoodie coming with the, the suit as far as the package and bundle that we've put together. So there's that review of the Mari's Seal Skin Wetsuit with hoodie available from our site. I think it's great for anyone that's diving in cooler and cold waters. So if you guys are enjoying the product reviews, please feel free to subscribe to the YouTube channel or go check out our social streams. The main one being facebook.com forward slash scuba.co.za. We'll keep you up to date with all the cool things that we've got going on on an ongoing basis. So that's it from me guys, and I look forward to seeing you really soon in the water.